Well, good morning. In my last couple of videos, I was looking at these um, 3 watt mono Bluetooth amplifiers. And the first one that I tested, um, I had a problem with the range of it. Uh, I had a second one that seemed to work perfectly. Um, so I went ahead and ordered uh, five more of them to see uh, if I could get any consistency out of them. Well, they've come in and uh, in short they're all working fantastically um, so the problems that I was having in that first video was probably just a bad board um, the board probably had a bad antenna or a bad chip um, the one thing that I saw in the last videos was that the um, that the numbering on the main chip here was different between the uh, the non-functioning and the functioning chip well I'll put a little thing on the screen but basically all these chips um, have different numbers uh, I think a couple of them have the same number but I'm really not sure what the, that numbering system is whether it's a, uh, a lot number or a, a manufacturing date number or some sort of code on there it's, it's certainly not the name of the chip um, but just to show you how well this thing works um, I have one here set up on the bench and it's really simple I just have 5 volts coming in here from the lab power supply and I have an output here going to this speaker um, now this has two outputs they're, they're marked left and right on the uh, on the board but it's a mono signal coming out, so the same signal is coming out of the left channel and the right channel. So let me go ahead and set this up and uh, I'll show you how this thing sounds. Um, the range on these things is pretty good. Uh, I'm getting at least 10 meters on them. And um, I can go around corners and, and things like that. So the problem that I was having on that first chip, or that first video, um, seems to have been a defective uh, a defective board because like I say the rest of these things are working pretty good so I'll just be back in a second and I'll have this all set up for you alright we're back um, I'm gonna go ahead and turn on the 5 volt power supply and this thing's gone ahead and paired and got some royalty free music for playing So the volume control on this board is controlled by your Bluetooth device. Well that sounds pretty good. Um, you know, for a little 3 watt amplifier, this thing's putting out a fair amount of volume. And uh, I'm not getting a whole lot of distortion up at the uh, high end of the volume range. So, overall, I'm pretty happy with this. So, I think I'm going to start to use these things in, um, in little cigar box players or Mod modification of, of little speakers like this so um, thanks for watching <laughs>